Hey everybody, Nick here, also known as the Bearded Housewife, and welcome to another Witches, Bats, and Paper Crafts video. Today I have two really simple and really fun insert cards for you. This is my Halloween Friends insert card. Super fun with all the different characters, Frankenstein, the mummy, the jack-o'-lantern, and that spider just flowing down right there. And then this is my Trick or Treat Flight insert card. That fun witch there in the center, bats flying around, soaring through the sky. I think that's super fun. Both of these projects are included within the download and they can also be made with any Cricut cutting machine. If you're using the Cricut Joy, you're gonna to want to use a pre-made card base and envelope that's included with the Cricut insert card packs. Now let's grab our materials and get started. Step one, get the SVG cut file. This project was part of Witches, Bats, and Paper Crafts 2023. If you'd like to purchase the individual cut file for this project, you can head to my shop at shop.thebeardedhousewife.com. This project is also available with the VIP Access Pass. With the VIP Access Pass, you get access to all 12 event files plus bonus cut files printable worksheets, and commercial licensing. For more information on the VIP Access Pass, you can head to thebeardedhousewife.com slash WBPC2023. I have both links listed in the video description. Step 2. Upload the design to Cricut Design Space. Now that we have a new project open in Cricut Design Space, we can go ahead and click Upload, Upload Image, and Browse. Find where we downloaded the file onto our computer and click Open and Upload. Highlight the image and click Add to Canvas. Step 3. Convert score lines and any text. Now that the project has been brought into our canvas, we can go ahead and ungroup the design. There's a few things that we need to do as far as the score lines, so let's look down the layers panel and find the envelope. Highlight the score lines. Come up to the operation menu and change that to score. Highlight the group and attach. And then we need to do the same thing for the card base. Highlight the score line. Change that to score. Highlight the group and attach. Once those two things are done, you can go ahead and click Make It. I'll be using the mats for this project. And you can see the different mats for this project. Go ahead and click Continue. I'll be using medium cardstock for this project. I'll go ahead and get everything cut out and I'll see you when it's time to assemble. Step four, cut out the design. Step 5. Assemble your card. Okay, so I have the card all cut out, so it's time to go ahead and put it together. The first thing that we're going to do is fold along the score line on the card base. And we can go ahead and burnish that fold. Open up that card base and just insert our insert piece into those slits and there is our fun Halloween card I'll set that to the side and I'll show you how to make the envelope so for the envelope we're just going to go ahead and fold and burnish along the score lines
and glue to the outer edge of the inlay panel. Place the inlay over the cutout on the envelope. Spin the envelope around. Fold those side flaps in. Add our glue to the bottom of the side flaps. With our thumbs, go ahead and push up and press. And then that forms our envelope. And here are our two different Halloween insert cards. We have the Halloween friends here, and then this is called the Trick or Treat Flight. Both of these are included in the download. Super, super fun. Aren't these insert cards adorable? I love both of them, and I hope that you make them. If you do make these, I hope that you share it with me. Whether that be through our Facebook group or email, I would love to see your creations. Until next time, I'm Nick, I'm the Bearded Housewife, and I will see you at the next Witches, Bats, and Paper Crafts video. Bye!